uh, a little bit more like that theme of glue time. And so, um, so those were certainly a step in the right direction, but I think ultimately it culminates in probably what I think is the best growth hormone secretagogue, which is the tetramorlin. Oh, really? Okay. We do use that in the clinic, mm-hmm. um, it, it, mostly for weight loss purposes. Um, yeah. but, but you think that may be even better than Ipromoil and the CJC combined? Yeah, certainly. Well, I think that, uh, the IGF one benefits are certainly larger. The average increase in IGF one with testimonial is, is on average 181 points, um, which is, you know, a very large increase. And, uh, and so I think that depending on how much growth hormone stimulation you need, um, it's certainly a good avenue. But uh, the reductions in visceral adipose tissue, the uh, improvements in cognition, uh, the reduction in carotid into a media thickness, all of those are benefits which have been really heavily um, uh, proven with the tessamorlin. Mm, okay. Mm-hmm. Um, and does that one come with DAC as well? It doesn't. Um, so it, it is actually a 44 amino acid peptide, um, and it's got a, a, a small lipid molecule at the end. Um, and uh, that gives it a really good stability um, and gives it really good potency. 